Marvel selling everything kind of gave the MCU this strange serendipity where they had these like C grade characters and C grade characters have really boring powers, but mm. they also have really interesting stories. And so, I mean, mind you, you could do a lot of Batman. You can't always do a lot with Superman unless you know what you're doing. And so I think DC has stumbled out of the gate because they've had their best characters and it's just like, okay, what do we do with that? Right. But you know, when you have to start with the bottom of the barrel, that's where you get interesting. You know, that's why Suicide Squad by James Gunn works so well because James Gunn knows how to work with garbage. Yeah. Your garbage characters is where you get the interesting stuff. That's when it works. Um, so Booster Gold has so much potential. I mean, Requires I mean, this actually right instead of just I know, like, yeah. Like, oh look, Superman, he can, he can burst through walls. Okay. All right. Yeah. So then what else matters that you can just do everything? Yeah. So yeah. Booster Gold, okay. meanwhile, just runs into walls that he puts on himself. And it is glorious. Think you could lighten up for just one second, Mr. McGrumpy Pants? Do I have to remind you that you're the reason we're in this mess? Because he just, he doesn't understand. Booster Gold is an idiot and it's wonderful. And I, for one, want more idiots in comics. <laughs> so more idiots in comic book movies, 2023. Give me a hell yeah! There you go. So, so you know, for our fans out there that that aren't familiar with Booster Gold, can you just give a little bit of background about the comics, the story? Because I mean, Booster Gold I think is there's a lot of people out there that uh, you know, a lot like, of who? fans out there are like, who? Is, yeah, what is going on? He's... And that's what I want to do with this episode is explain why this is going to be interesting and why it's yeah. going to be great for DC. He's he's an absolute loser. For, so he's from the future, and in his time period, he's a loser. He's like. No, everyone hates him. Oh, what a loser. He's he's a, a loser. loser. And so he comes to the past and he's like, I have future technology. I can save all of you. Mm -hmm. But when you're a bumbling fool, you're going to be a bumbling fool no matter what year it is. Road trip. I call shotgun. Intelligence. Technology does not help you if yeah. you're just stupid. Um, <laughs> so he comes to our time like modern times and he's like i'm gonna help you batman superman wonder woman and they just watch him run around and make bigger messes 